There she is. Oh, yeah, again with the computer. You have to write a paper. Now? I mean, can't you take a break? Let's go get a drink or something. Can you just leave me alone, please? Morgan, I'm just trying to look after you. You know, you're, you're in a corner at a party, surfing the web. I'm it's not just surfing the people web. People are gonna think. It, it's just not a cool thing to do, you know? Yeah, well, I don't really care what people think. Th then what are you doing here at all? Yeah, that's a good question. Wait, Morgan, get out of here. Like that. Leaving. Morgan! See ya. Hey! Morgan just stormed out. What's up with that? To be honest, I have no idea what's been going on with her lately. She's like really distracted. I know, right? And yeah. what's with her being online constantly? I mean, I know. Facebook is so last week. No, right? no, it's not Facebook. That's a thing. She's not on Facebook. She never posts anything on there. I don't know what she's doing. Do you think there's something more going on with her? I mean, I feel like her whole personality is changing. I know that, but what can I do about it? I've known her that long. I mean, you're the one that's been friends with her since like kindergarten. Or, uh, Sixth grade. Oh, right. So <laughs> Get not right. that long. <laughs> anyway, I mean, if you don't know. I mean, maybe she's just going through a phase or something. Maybe. Or like the worst period ever. Shut up. <laughs> What you doing, kiddo? Morgan. Wait, you're not talking to me now? Morgan? Morgan! 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 What the hell's wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? Stop it! You're looking at what is Don't weird touch crap. that! Um, I'm getting pretty concerned about Morgan. Lately, she hasn't been herself for a couple weeks, but I, I couldn't tell you when it first started to change. Um, she's constantly online, uh, and she's not doing classwork. I don't know what she's doing or uh, who she's doing it with. I don't know if she's met somebody who's a bad influence. Yeah, there's tons of perps out there on the internet, but, um, I just, I'm just really worried about her. So, what is this for? It's just for me. Don't be nervous. You should. Your hair looks really gay. Brave talk wearing that shirt. <laughs> I rock this shirt. By the way, if you're going to put this online, you should definitely have one of us be naked. I'm just saying, you get a lot more hits. OK, guys, be serious, wow. please. Wow. We're starting to, guys, <laughs> guys, I'm we're starting the okay, I'm sorry. Go ahead. You ready? Yes. Have either of you noticed anything strange about Morgan lately? I don't really know. You guys were practically like a couple on you. No, we, we hung out. Uh, I guess we dated a little bit. Um, I don't know, she stopped answering my calls. So, I haven't even seen her for like two weeks. Yeah, yeah, me neither. Not even in class. To be honest, I, I, I thought we were like uh, Yeah, I'm sorry, I, I'm sorry though. Nah, it's whatever, it's cool. Cameron, you're majoring in linguistics, right? Linguistic analysis. Sorry. Big money in that. Fuck you. What do you make of this? What is it? I was hoping you could tell me. I just took a snapshot of Morgan's computer and I what? caught all this crazy writing on it. This looks oriental. Uh, I think what he means is Asian. That'd be the correct Shut term. Up, dude. Come on. Not I, in linguistics. Oh. 
This isn't any known language I've ever seen. This was on Morgan's screen? Yeah. What was she doing? Reading it. No, that's not possible. She was, and, and she reads it all the time. I mean, this is just one moment, but it, she, I catch no, her No, I'm, I'm telling you, that's not possible. Uh, Relax, man. <laughs> Take it easy. Look, you don't just read dead languages, okay? I know. I'm devoting my entire life to this. That takes years of study. That's why I'm asking you, can you just maybe look into it or just find out something? I don't know if I can read this. I... He'll do it. Don't worry about it. Don't tell her I'll do it. Please, just... Cameron. <sighs> okay. No promises. I'll see what I can do, but... He'll take care of it, don't worry. He'll totally figure it out. This guy is crazy smart. Like Rain Man smart. Trust me. Damn, I hate you. No, you don't. <laughs> My computer. I'm not touching that freaking thing again. Okay, so when I reviewed the video from the other night, I was able to pick up on a URL from the site that Morgan was on. Asking me to register. Yeah, that's when I need more spam in Chinese. Wait, let me try something. Morgan Shane. <gasps> Sorry. Damn, Anna. You look like crap, bro. Dude, you, you can't just Don't see it. Don't worry about me, guys. I'm, you're a dick. Hey, I'm just saying. Hey, did you find out anything? Yeah. 
Well, I got first guess. It is Oriental. It's called Archaic Chinese. It was used between 1200 BC to 3rd century BC, but I mean, this is nothing like modern Chinese. It's more like Middle Eastern hieroglyphics. So how was Morgan reading it? That's what I'm saying. There's no way that she could be. This, unless she's some secret brainiac scholar of ancient Chinese, it's not possible. You guys know she was part Chinese, right? No way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like a 16th on her dad's side? Something like that. So what? I mean, that gives her some magic ability to read ancient Chinese? No, I'm just saying it's interesting. It's kind of a coincidence. I mean, dude, you go back far enough, everybody's part of everything. Okay, I get that. I know. We all descended from Adam and Eve. Adam I and understand. Eve? Dude, shut up. I'm embarrassed that you even go to this school sometimes. Cameron, what? is there a symbol that looks anything like this in the language? Yes. I mean, that looks... It looks familiar, but I can't read any of this. I asked all my professors, and this stuff is out there. There's, uh, there's probably a handful of people that actually know how to read it, and Morgan can't be one of them. I'm sorry. It's just not possible. What the hell does all this mean? I have no idea. What do you think it means? And I just don't know what to do anymore. She won't talk to me. And I called her mom and she won't talk to her. Her grades are off the chart. They're non-existent. And I mean, they're, she's lucky they don't kick her out of school. Morgan, hey, uh, can we talk oh, for a Christ. second? Look, it, just one second. I, I, not with that thing running. It's what I do, you know that besides Oh my god. What is that thing on your neck? A tat? So what? Uh, you do realize that's permanent, right? That you're gonna have yeah. to live with that for the rest of your life? Yeah, I got it. I don't give a shit. What is your mom gonna say when she sees that I thing? I don't give a shit what she says or you. Can you turn that fucking thing off for like five minutes? Fine. I thought we were friends. Yeah, well, I guess we're not, Anna, because friends give each other some space, and right now you're all up in mine. What? I I'm just supposed to sit back and watch this happen to you? What, what happened to me? Whatever it is! What? That... What? What? That's... What? Spit it out that I'm finding myself? That I'm becoming an independent woman while you're still a little goody goody Barbie doll playing pussy? This isn't your talking. Hell yeah, it is. And let's get something straight here. I may share this room with you, but we don't share a life. Those days are over and that's how I'm keeping it. And I'm so fucking sick and tired of every fucking second of our lives being recorded. How do you like it, Anna? Oh, smile for the camera, Anna. Every second, it's so annoying. Stop! You know stop! 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 Morgan, wait! Don't you touch me! Don't you ever touch me! We were friends, Morgan. Our friends! I don't care what you say, I'm not gonna let you destroy yourself. You listen to me. From now on, what I do, where I go, none of your concern. Stay out of my way, stay out of my life, or you'll be very, very sorry. So you guys know that I post stuff on my blog all the time, right? <laughs> Duh. Yeah. No oh, shit. Hold on, don't move. Dramatic zoom in. Obviously, I haven't been posting all the stuff that's been happening with Morgan in the past month or two. But. I think I'm just fine. Publicly? I don't know, maybe if more people know, then the more we can help her. Yeah. Don't you think that's kind of a major invasion of her privacy, though? I. I believe that her life is in danger. Well, I mean, that's a little dramatic. Yeah, it is. The whole thing is. That's what I've been trying to tell you guys. Look, I'm, I'm sorry, but you have to think, what if it backfires? I mean, you, you, could, you could completely chase your best friend away and not even mean to. I know, I know. Maybe if I confront her about it, or 
I thought you did that. Yeah, but it was all emotional and angry. I, maybe I just sit down with her and talk rationally with her. I mean, we could go with you. Thanks, but I think she'll just feel more comfortable if it's just the two of us. When are you going to do it? Well, I know she's alone in our room right now. Doing what? Guess. Morgan, can I come in? I, I think we need to talk. Check this out. Wait, wait, wait. Let me get this. Come on. Hey, come on. hey, what's up? Can we help you, sweetheart? What's the matter? Oh, Cat man. got your tongue? I have under here, honey. Hey. Oh, <laughs> you are a bad girl. Hey, aren't cut you? it out. Can't you see something's wrong with her? Shut up, Dave. You're such a tool. Well, we're going to make it all better, right, baby? I'm going to go find a campus pop or something. You do want to fucking kick your ass. <laughs> no, we're going to have a fun with Victoria's Secret. First thing. Ah! Ah! Oh god, oh no!
dog, dog all, all the time. Okay. So it's really it stressful right now. It's gonna happen, right? It's not fucking happening. Officer down. We have officer down. Oh, Jesus Christ! Shots fired. Sent back up immediately. Fuck. Oh, God! Hey, hey, miss. Honey, yeah, sure. you gotta move back a little. Can't be here. What's going on? It's an official school business. What the hell does that mean? Hey, it means it has nothing to do with you, Green Jay. So move it along. Hey, we pay tuition here, so we got a right to know. Yeah, you also have the right to my size 11D up your keister. So move it along. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What was that? Phone? What are you doing? This? Hey, you want to keep that thing and shut it off now? Hey, you hear me? Now! Okay. I'm concealing your identity at your request, so for the purpose of this interview, I'll call you John. Is that okay? Yeah, sure. Now, uh, tell us, John, you were a California state trooper, correct? Yes. But you had another job for them, right? I was a data forensic specialist. And are you my source for the dash cam video that captured the March 13th encounter between officers Gennaro and Meyer and Morgan Shane? Yes, I was. Is this unusual for official police videos to be released? 
technically they're public property. They're often released to these people, other government agencies. But not usually to private citizens like me. No. And why did you release it to me? Wait, what? Why did you release it to me? Because there was an attempt to destroy the video. Could, could you elaborate? I want to see the video for myself. But when I went to it, it had been deleted. I was told the camera malfunctioned. But then I found a backup copy in a classified partition of the server. And why did you take such a particular interest in this video? Janeiro and I were friends. We came to the academy together. He's the first officer we see on the video. He's the one. Yeah. He was a good guy. And what happened to you as a result of your actions? I was fired. Stood to my pension. Was it your immediate superiors within the force that were responsible for that? No, I don't think so. Yeah. Someone much higher up. At the governor's office. Maybe higher. It was implied that the... You know, there's, the rumor is that, you know, I don't think this is a good idea. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry? Hey, I'm, uh, I'm, I turn off the camera, I'm done. This is important, you agree? Hey, it's, I got a wife and two kids, all right? Now turn off the fucking camera. I just don't understand why you've come all this way. Are you still filming? Why are you still filming? So turn the fuck Radio Jedna
supernatural forces do exist in this universe. And what's more, the binary code that is the foundation of our digital communications shares a fundamental architecture with these paranormal entities. I know this because I have discovered it myself. Anna? This Where's is Anna? the true threat of global interconnectivity, not loss of privacy or state agent hackers. It is the opening of a portal into our world that can and will be exploited by forces which we cannot comprehend.
Well, I applaud your tenacity. I do. You have found Milos. I don't know how you found me exactly, but I'm betting you have something rather nasty breathing down your neck. Well, you wouldn't have searched quite so hard, would you? Perhaps something even as frightening as Chiyotso. Huh? Yes, you see? I know exactly what you're up against. But I doubt that you do. So, this is how this must work. I will talk and you will listen. You will do exactly as I instruct you. And then, maybe, just maybe, I will help you. But first, you, my friend, require an education. I assume you're aware by now that your computer is infected with the virus known as Daemon 9.175X. But do you know what it is? Daemon 9. Dot, whatever the fuck it is, is the handiwork of Tai Zhengguo, a senior programmer at GUI Microsystems in Guangdong, China, who is one of the few people in the world, besides myself, to decipher the digital link between binary code and the paranormal world. It's true. An odd little fellow. He worshipped the ancient warrior god, Chiu Tso. In fact, he even slit his own throat in sacrifice to him, thus becoming the very resurrection of Chiu Tso which was then encoded into virus form and implanted in GUI's very popular D9 chipset, which I can see... Ah, yes, you have one soldered onto your motherboard, you lucky consumer. Now, about Chiu Tso. I have seen some ugly, malicious beings in my day, but none quite as dangerous or bloodthirsty. The Catholic's Lucifer could take lessons. Hmm. According to legend, Chi Utso will return to rule the earth one day, but he must first find a queen. This is where I suspect your little friend comes in. Morgan Shane, is it? Hmm. Chinese blood in her lineage, I suspect. Ever since, the good people at GUI, who, by the way, uh, their CEO is Tai Zhengguo's daddy, uh, have been doing their level best to try and erase the destruction that's already begun, uh, even pressing upon their friends in the United States government, while they try to put the genie back in the bottle. And that's where you came in and decided to... Uh, how do they say? A get involved. It's impressive, isn't it? The divide between what some people know and what they only think they know. Hmm. But I digress. You require a firewall, my friend, the kind that only I can build. And so I shall. All you need to do is give me temporary control of your system. Go on. I, I understand your reticence. I do. I do. But I'm afraid I must insist. Fine. Guard your precious privacy. See how well it protects you.
Hey, all right, um, we don't have much time. Who, who the fuck are you? How did you connect with me? Where did you get, like, cause no one can find me online, like no one. Oh, oh shit, no, 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 don't, 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 don't say anything. I, you had help finding me. Oh Christ, shit. I covered like every track I left and it's still filming, which means found you first. Do not tell me who you are. I don't want to know. Just tell me one thing, okay? Did Morgan Shane contact you? Did she speak to you? Oh, Christ. She must have let it to you and then you let it straight to him. You don't know who you're dealing with, do you? You just went online one day. Oh, you Stupid whore. Oh. Alright. You're gonna do exactly what I tell you to do. And then, you never saw me. Okay? You lose this link. I never want to hear from you again. You got it? Okay, give me your email address. Type it in that window. What are you waiting for? What, you don't want my help? Uh, fine. Fuck you then. And good luck on your own, asshole, because that thing obviously has you riding its crosshairs. scary over there, hmm? You know, this isn't a movie, Jerkoff. This shit's real. Now, your email address, please. All right, check your email. You need to know what you're up against. It might just save your life. Morgan spoke to you, huh? What did she say? No, she don't tell me, I don't wanna know. I didn't really know her, like I wanted to, but that's why I made the copies of Anna's blog. Morgan, I wanted to, like I wasn't a creep, I, I, I like, I just really thought she was amazing. And I'd watch the clips and Felt like I knew her. Maybe if I'd reached out, things could have been different. 
Like, I, I don't know you. Um, but Morgan has chosen you for a reason. Maybe you can save her. Like, thousands of people have checked out that website. You're the first person she's ever spoken to. And you found me. You know, I have to go, but... Check your email. Do exactly what it says. And don't trust anyone. Or anything. Tell me, are you afraid? I hope you are, because you should be. I have ways of protecting myself online. You? You clearly don't.